Matt Step, Dave Campbell's Texas Football here at Madisonville High School. Here at the head coach of the area round champion, Lorena Leopards, Coach Ray Biles, after an impressive 50 to six win over over Woodville. And Coach, you know, you get into the playoffs, especially the second round, you, you never expect to win a game by a big margin like this. Uh, but I, mean, I know you're really happy. I mean, how how well do you feel like your kids played tonight? You know, that may have been the most complete ball game we played all year, Matt, on both sides of the ball, offensively and defensively. You know, we came out in the first series, they knocked us back, you know, hit us in the face in a hurry. And, uh, you know, it was kind of a wake up, you know, uh, but I thought our kids responded well for the rest of the first half. We finally got some things together. Our coaches did a tremendous job of getting the ball where it needed to be. And, and same thing on defense. I thought our defensive staff did a great job of, of having kids in the right spot. And then uh, kids made plays, and that's huge. I thought your, your special teams in the first quarter was big. Your, your punt team was able to flip the field. Uh, you know, you, you had the win in the first quarter, and your special teams were able to put them, you know, pin them back. And, and, and at that first touchdown, I think you had a 40-yard field, and that really came because of the special teams pinning them on their own 10-yard line and you, your defense getting a stop. Uh, it, as you get further in the playoffs, you, you're going to need all three phases to come through if you want to make that run like you guys think you have a chance to, right? No doubt about it. I mean, anytime you can, you know, change, it's a whole lot easier to score from 40 yards out than, than 80 or 90. I, I know that. So, uh, yeah, Jaden punted the ball well, got a couple of really good rolls on it, and and then we had a couple of good punt returns also that, that got us back down in, in position to, to make some plays. So it is it's something our kids work at and they take pride in. Offensively, I, I thought you, your balance was key. You, you were able to obviously hit some big plays in the passing game and, and stretch the field a little bit, but I, I thought your offensive line and your ground game uh, did a good job as well in opening up holes for your running backs. Uh, that balance was key tonight. How, how, how big has your offensive line been for you guys this year? They've been – one of the you know the heart and soul of our ball club. I mean those guys week in and week out uh, haven't had a bad night. You know you know they've done a great job and, and the main thing I think they've done is progressed each week from September to where we are now at the end of November. Just a tremendous group of kids, uh, hardworking. They're they're the ones that go out and compete every Monday and Tuesday afternoon when it you know when we've got to get better. They do that so. Uh, it's a great bunch of kids, and, and it, you know, our, our, our backs love it. You know, when they get the ball and, you know, all I've got to do is get up there, there's going to be a space, and that's huge for them. So, uh, you know, it's it's uh, been a good mix-up, and as we well know, whenever you can do those things well, it opens some passing lanes for you and give you a chance to throw the ball. Now, when you win in the second round of the playoffs, most years, it means you're practicing on Thanksgiving Day. And so you guys are going to uh, play through Thanksgiving Thanksgiving holiday. That, that's a special time. Uh, it means you're deep in the playoffs. Uh, how, how do you approach the holiday week? You know, kind of balance the family, you know, the kids spending time with their family. But also, you know, there's there's work to be done next weekend in the third round of the playoffs. Uh, it's a special time. But how do you balance that as a coaching staff? Well, you're, you're absolutely right. We try to do as much of that as we can in the mornings. You know, we don't have school next week because of the holidays. So we'll, we'll be up there in the morning. And uh, I also like getting the kids out of bed, stay routine-wise of what you're doing. And so we'll get them up, and probably most of our workouts will be all in the morning uh, and try to give them the afternoons and evenings to be at home with family. Uh, you know, our, our staff will be working hard this weekend trying to get another game plan put together, uh, and that's just part of what we do. So, uh, you know, I, I, I love our guys. Our guys are tremendously hard workers, and, and I'm blessed. Uh, do, you, do you, you know, tomorrow you got, you got the winner of Anahuac and uh, Columbus, two good ball clubs, obviously. Uh, do you hit the road? Do you, do you and the coaches hit the road tomorrow and go scout it, or do you just kind of wait for the huddle film to come in? What's the, what's the game plan here this weekend? Well, I had an opportunity to see Columbus last week in, in person. I may, get, may drive to Houston, may not. It just depends on, you know, how I feel. And <laughs> <laughs> Technology makes it a little easier, right? It absolutely does. But, uh, you know, I know both of those clubs, uh, Coach Nice over at Anahuac and, and Coach Shovel at, at Columbus, a tremendous coaches, great programs, and you know we're going to have to be prepared again. They're they're both either one of those two will be a great opponent. Final question for you. This is a fun question. With it being Thanksgiving weekend coming up, what's your favorite side dish at Thanksgiving dinner? What, what's what's the go-to for Coach Biles? Cranberries. Cranberries. I love cranberry sauce. Yeah. There you go. I it. With it, it, only if you can get on top of the the dressing. There you so, go. All right. Okay. All right. Well, Coach, I appreciate it. Happy Thanksgiving and congrats to your ball club. And uh, we'll see you next week. Thank you, Matt. Appreciate you. Hey, thanks for watching this clip here on YouTube. If you like this kind of stuff and you want more of it, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. And remember, you can watch us live every weekday at noon at TexasFootball.com, Facebook, Twitch, or here on YouTube. And if you want more of the best coverage of football in the state of Texas, check out TexasFootball.com and become a Dave Campbell's Texas Football Insider at TexasFootball.com slash subscribe.